everyone, this is RainingStar87, and today we're playing a brand new game, The Curious Expedition! We're now in Alpha 11, New Frontiers. And this is a game that uh, both Kiri and Scar have been playing, but it's brand new to me. And by brand new, I mean not really. I played through it a few times, so I don't look like a complete and total idiot, but uh, it's still going to be comical because I am really bad at this game. But let's go ahead and uh, start a new game. And so, I've unlocked a bunch of different characters. It really doesn't help me any. Unfortunately, I'm just not very good. Um, so, I either like to go with Charles Darwin or Amelia Earhart. Or, um... Yeah, we'll go with one of those two. So, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, Darwin it is. Welcome back to the Explorers Club, old friend. Have you heard that we are building a statue to honor the expeditions of our most famous member? Where it is that you have a good chance of seeing your likeness on that statue? No, no, I have a very poor chance of that ever happening. However, I'm afraid to tell you that you are not the only candidate. Thank goodness. You and your rivals have six expeditions to prove who is the most famous explorer within our club. Hmm, let's take a bet. Who's going to win? Let's go with Isabella. Now, go adventure. There, go explore. Adventure awaits. Okay. Alright, so of course then we pick where we want to go. We have the opulent grasslands. The monstrous grasslands. Fortune is exploring this region. Interesting. What does that mean? I don't know. Oh, for <laughs> I'm foolish. It's like, what does that mean? Alright. The air was fresh and tasted of salt as I boarded the ship. A captain had yet to arrive, so I had one last pot of tea. A missionary approached me while we waited. We had had come to these lands and demanded that we take them to a nearby native village in order to spread the word of God. Okay, sure, fine. I accepted since I was gladly helped to spread the word of God. At last, our vessel is ready to depart. So let's set sail. Alright, the missionary had pinpointed the location of the village he wanted us to visit on the map. Onward to the village! Except I really want to figure out what's over here. So let's go over here first. Ooh. We examined the strange overgrown granite sculpture. It's cold eyes. To look right at us, it was a disconcerting sight, and we desired to move on. We saw a few items by the statue. They must have been put there by the natives. So let's examine and see what we got. Ooh. Okay, this is some good stuff. So I know we're going to get in a lot of trouble for doing this. But we're going to take it anyway. So let's see. Alright, let's have a look at our Trek members. We have an alcoholic missionary, but we'll get rid of him soon, so that's not that big of a deal. We have a claustrophobic interpreter. And we have a superstitious guard. Oh, this is going to shape up to be a nice little journey now, isn't it? I don't want to use... Oh, whatever. We'll use the machete. We have ten of them. And I have no idea what... There we go. It's like, I don't know what's up with my cursor. Alright, we have reached the village. Today we reached the village. Warrior tribes. Excellent. Excellent. Let's get rid of them. So, the village guy pinpoints us to a holy shrine. Excellent. So, let's go ahead and... Actually, let's see if we can rest in the village. Excellent, we can. We spent an enjoyable evening with the natives. Later that night, Hermushi Sathana approached me with a request. He had fallen in love with one of the natives and desired to leave our trek and stay with his beloved. No! Oh, I really have no choice but to... Uh, he's a low-level character, so we'll say yes. No one should stand in the way of love. I wish some luck. Of course, now we're overburdened. So what can I get rid of? I don't want to get rid of anything. Alright, let's see if we can recruit somebody from the village. Wouldn't that be lovely? We asked around. An animal handler? 
Ah, uh, sure, why not? He felt welcome. Excellent. So, let's actually see what the villagers have. Anything I want? No. Alright, so let's get out of here. We packed up the trek and departed. Excellent. But I'm going to go over here. And we're just going to have to pause just one second. Be right back. And we're back. Sorry about that pause. But uh, anyway, did I remember to turn the music back on? Yes, I did. Anyway, all right. So let's see. We can level somebody up in the party. So let's see. Do we want to... No, we want to go with... Yeah. He'll be good in a fight later. Oh, nice. He's a whiskey expert. Hmm. Trading caravan. Let's see. We got some stuff to trade. Trading caravan was set up in front. What do you got to trade? Let's see. We've got dynamite, chocolate. Let's see. Let's get some chocolate. Um. Can we do it? Yeah. So we'll pick up a couple of Actually, no, we're not going to do that, because we don't need the chocolate. So we're actually going to take it all back. But anyway, chocolate restores your sanity, which is greater... F which is good for later on. But anyway, we'll continue on our trek. Let's see. Um, We're actually not going to check this out, because we've got a full inventory and I'd be s I would want to steal actually I lie we're going to check it out because I probably am going to steal the idol thing we stood before a temple comprised of stones the size of a small wagon it was a bold testament to the power of the creators something seemed strange about this place I could not help myself but notice that the shadows seemed to be longer and darker than usual I'm not familiar with that one we had found a sacred altar room. Let's investigate. <gasps> cool stuff. Okay. So, what do I want to get rid of? I'll get rid of the torches. I'll pick some up later. We want that. And let's get rid... I want to keep that. I want to keep that. We're actually going to leave the mummy. Ooh, something felt wrong as we obtained the treasure. We were shocked as horrible creatures crawled out of the shadows and moved towards us. While it certainly looked scary, it did not seem to be aggressive towards us. For some reason, it had decided to follow us, which was rather disconcerting. I would say so. That's a little creepy. That's... Oh, great. Now we... Oh my gosh. We have a grotesque abomination following us. Which is kind of cool, I think. Until it decides to eat us. I bet it's going to eat us. But anyway, it appears to be an excellent... That is interesting. So, I know there's probably nothing... Well, actually, let's go... We need to go over there. Because that's probably... Yes, it's a healing spring. I bet you that's going to be my temple. But anyway, let us, first of all, level somebody up. Um, we will promote our animal handler. And then we will explore the spring. We tried to stop at a place of outstanding natural beauty. The water tasted salty. Its healing properties were more than obvious. Let's rest overnight. I heard unusual sounds. I hurried to find out what was happening and found Missy Ninnis had been attacked by the abomination. Well, we need her. Or do we? We don't. But if we protect it, then we'll have to fight the abomination, and he is ridiculously powerful. Um. Nah, we'll save him. This will be the end of us, I can almost guarantee it. 
All right, we'll take the shield. What else do we got? Nothing. Anything. Tactical advantage. Do I got any more? Nope. Okay, we'll do that. Oh boy. Okay, we got an aimed shot for four damage. What's the other one do? Shotgun blast for three. No, aim shot for four. And... A kick. Of course, this means we're gonna get slaughtered this round. Oh, we're still alive, somehow. Alright, what was on it? Two pieces of meat? Okay, we'll take that. Great! Well, that was fun. Oh, sweet. Okay, we'll do one more rest overnight, because we've had our heals. Um, great. Let's ignore. Okay, people don't like things. That's great. Okay. So, let's see. Maybe that's my temple? It is my temple! The majestic golden pyramid rose above the environment, overcoming all the obstacles we had yet survived. Enter! Uh, Huma approached me and stated that we would not follow me to the civilized world. Alright, so, you know. That's alright. So, let's see. Our current fame was 10. We get 100 for this golden pyramid. We found... We get 10 points for the butterflies. And it only took us 63 days, so 57. Not the best ever, but we'll go with it. Anyway, so let's see. Now we get to pick an award. So let's see, Jungle Explorer, Desert Explorer, or Navigator. Hmm. Let's go with Jungle Explorer. Because none of those perks were really that great. Alright, we are far behind, but that's okay. We brought back some junk. Okay, so let's... Give the Golden Goblet to the museum for 60 fame. Let's see, that's worth 20 fame, so let's give it to the museum. Let's give it to the museum. You're worth more money, so we'll sell you for 40. And then sell you for 60. And that starts our next expedition. So we're up to about 8 minutes, so this is Rain Star 87 plays Curious Expedition, a brand new awesome game that you can pick up on Steam. Um, I don't know, if you like it, we might continue playing this game, I don't know. We'll see how my schedule works, but anyway, this is Rain Star 87 and we will catch you all next time.